Over the years, SOLIDWORKS has provided us with some amazing user-driven enhancements focused on modeling more robust assemblies faster. SOLIDWORKS 2023 continues that history of excellence with these new capabilities. Creating assembly patterns can save time and maximize proficiency. In previous versions of SOLIDWORKS, multiple configurations along with multiple pattern features made it difficult to create the different permutations without extra features that feel redundant. Now in SOLIDWORKS 2023, designers have the option to configure the instances to skip assembly patterns. In addition, we can specify which configurations are affected by the instances skipped. For this roller assembly, we may want to switch the roller to a type with a rubberized wheel. The Replace Component command in 2023 now allows you to replace a single bearing, all the bearings in the top level assembly, or all instances of that bearing in every level of that complete assembly. During the Replace command, a rebuild error occurs. A simple mismatched face ID like this can derail your productivity. With SOLIDWORKS 2023, you will be excited to see a new auto repair feature built right into the context toolbar. It's also in the right mouse click menu on the mate group. The auto repair will look for similar face, edge, vertex, or reference geometry and attempt to reattach the missing items. A huge time saver for keeping your mates error free. These additional assembly configuration features in 2023 make accurate bill of material representations easier than ever. Now in 2023, a new document property is available for the default part number SOLIDWORKS uses in a new BOM configuration. This setting can be saved in your template to ensure the correct company standard part numbering is used every time. We often need to provide access to hardware by cutting several components and an assembly cut would be perfect for this situation. New to 2023, we now have all standard end conditions available to us, just the same as in part modeling mode. With the feature scope modified, we'll add this cut to the downstream parts by using Propagate Features to Parts. Also new in SOLIDWORKS 2023, toolbox components are automatically removed from the feature scope so as not to add unwanted features to off-the-shelf fasteners. Magnetic mates are a great way to speed up the layout process, and in SOLIDWORKS 2023, they're even more flexible. You can now suppress and unsuppress individual connection points. This new feature brings extended functionality to an already powerful way to approach your assembly process. We at Go Engineer have always suggested using lightweight mode in order to maximize your workstation's performance in SOLIDWORKS. However, you may still need to regularly switch to resolve mode via context toolbars or right mouse button clicks. In SOLIDWORKS 2023, you now have a new system option, optimized resolve mode automatically. This improves performance by selectively using lightweight technology when you load components in resolved mode. This will hide options for lightweight and resolved modes. Components will load as resolved and lightweight states will not appear in the feature tree. This will allow you to focus on design while still maximizing performance. When sharing very large step files with a customer or vendor, a failed multi-hour download or upload can cause a costly project delay. Based on SOLIDWORKS user feedback, now in 2023, you can save assemblies as multiple step files with separate smaller files for the top level, sub-assembly, and individual parts. You can easily get around this potential issue. With more flexible and powerful assembly features, automatic mate repair, and performance optimized resolve mode, SOLIDWORKS 2023 is an all-around amazing release for assembly designers.